In this video, I'm going to talk about a carb cycling diet that you can use if you're working out hard in the gym, if you want to reduce your body fat, but you also want enough energy for those hard workouts. Hello everyone, my name is Mike Kohler and I've been a fitness trainer and gym owner for over 25 years. And if this is your first time here and you really want to improve your fitness, health, and nutrition along with me, hit that subscribe button. I put out videos like this every single week. Okay, okay let's get right there. Let's talk about this carb cycling approach that I've used in the past that's really helped me lower my body fat while at the same time giving me a lot of energy for those good hard workouts in the gym. Now, if you've been following me on YouTube, you know that I've really been eating this modified ketogenic diet for a few years now. I really love it. I also follow time-restricted eating where I take in most of my calories and only an eight-hour eating window. I'm actually going to link up a great video I did about time-restricted feeding and eating and how to really incorporate that into your life. But I've been doing this for quite some time now, and I think I'm going to try for the next three months a nice traditional carb cycling, bodybuilding type diet. I'm going to up my protein, I'm going to cycle my carbs, and I'm going to reduce my fat. But let me explain to you this exact protocol that I've used in the past that's worked really, really well. Okay, when it comes to protein, I'm going to take in one gram of protein per pound of body weight. You know, basic approach, you've heard this before. You know, when I was doing the modified ketogenic diet, I was eating less protein. I was taking in about 0.75 grams per pound of body weight. So I'm going to up my protein a little bit. When it comes to my carbohydrates, for three days, I'm going to eat half the amount of grams of carbs per, per grams of protein or per body weight. So for example, if I'm 200 pounds, I'm only going to take in 100 grams of carbohydrates. I'm going to do this for three days. Okay. So what happens then is that I'm going to be, de be depleting my glycogen stores. By the time I get to the third day, I'll probably be in a mild state of ketosis. Now, if you want to learn about just muscle and liver glycogen, I did another great video explaining them in detail all about muscle and liver glycogen. So I'm going to keep my carbs, half of my protein for three days. And then on the fourth day, I'm going to go equal carbs, equal protein. Meaning that if you're 200 pounds, I'm going to eat 200 grams of carbohydrates. So I'm going to kind of fill up my muscle and liver glycogen stores so I have energy to work out, you know, for the next few days. Okay. And I'm going to keep my fat at about 25, 30%. Now I'm also going to eat really healthy. Okay. When it comes to the carbohydrates, I'm going to eat tons of vegetables, yams, sweet potatoes, you know, like resistant type starches, you know, I, so if I'm having white rice, I'll probably be cold white rice. You know, I'm going to eat really healthy, good carbs like that. You know, good, good protein sources, chicken, fish, meat, you know, all the eggs, whole eggs, things like that. And I'm going to take in, I'm a person who believes I love more monounsaturated fats. So I'm going to be cooking with olive oil and things like that. Okay. And I'm going to follow this for about three months. I took some pictures of myself this summer in this modified ketogenic point. I'm going to see how I look in three months and how I feel. You know, I could, I could jump ship in a few weeks if I don't feel good because I've been doing this modified keto for a long time. But you know, hey, it's good to experiment. It's not good to get stuck in. No, no one diet is great. Even if you think it's great, it's good to experiment and check it out. Okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give me a thumbs up. And remember, if you really want to improve your fitness, health, and nutrition along with me, hit that subscribe button. I put out videos like this every single week. And also, if you try to diet like this in the past, this traditional like carb cycling type, you know, type diet, you know, leave a comment. I'd like to know what you think. If you tried the modified keto, if you're ketogenic and you're thinking about making a change, leave a comment too. Take care, everyone, and have a wonderful day.